Here's Fuchsia. I'm afraid her, the male lamb is not going to make it. She's letting down just enough milk in the one teeth for the one lamb. So the yo lamb is staying with her and is alive and well. It was the stronger lamb all the time. The little ram lamb was very weak from the get-go. <laughs> Hence why it was sheltered and I was bottle feeding it quite soon after they um, came up here. <laughs> or soon after it was born. Because it just wasn't right. But that's nature. Nature is a very, very cruel taskmaster very cruel and just gotta live with it but she's gonna be fine with her single lamb hey you how are you just a bit and a loverly bit loverly bit you are very loverly aren't you no don't eat the lord and lady those are not good for lambs to nibble on except you won't nibble on them because you already know. Instinct is an amazing thing in sheep. They know what's good for them and they know what's not good for them. You just had to sniff it and you knew. There's Gotcha. And her little ram lamb. And then sheltering in here is Grace and her yo lamb Luna. Isn't that right, Grace? Yeah, she's sheltering in here. There was a torrential downpour and all the yo's were in the shed this morning after I was feeding and picked up the sick lamb. Oh, and it smells heavenly here under the cherry tree that's in bloom. I can't tell you. If it was smell-o-vision, you would love this smell. Cherry blossoms galore. So we now have four singles. And over here are the twins. Celandine and um, Dior. Celandine, you have a lamb missing. I know, I see it. It's next to the wall, fast asleep. Oh, it just woke up. can see one of her lambs is all the way over there against the wall, all on its own. The wall will be giving off a lovely ambient heat, which the lambs know about. She's doing the really good motherly thing. Her lambs are inside her, so she's blocking the wind. There's Celandine going to her lamb, but her lambs 
are on the inside of her. So you can see they are lovely and cozy up against the wall. You see that? She's a very good mama. So the wall is heating them from one side and the mother from the other. That's an excellent mother. And she's staring at me because, oh, where are you? There you are. This is here. Yeah, you're bold. You're bold. So I'm not gonna disturb them anymore. And they have flowering. These are two pear trees flowering above them. There's an elder. Those are scrub plum that are flowering or some are flowering and some are not. This is an apple tree. So we only have two sets of twins at the moment. And she knows she's missing. She's calling because she knows she's missing one of her lambs. She, she is finally looking for it. But she wasn't missing it earlier. How are you, just a bit? Inca, come on. Leave it. Come on. Come on, fat lady. Come on, pup. Come on. Out a girl. Hey, you. You're going to whelp soon, aren't you? Lambing and whelping all this week. <laughs>